Hearken to my word, ye that follow after truth, who seek instruction from Yahya. Consider that ye were cut out like a stone, hewn from a rock, that you were cut out like a mass, hewn out of a hollow system. Consider Abraham your father and Sarah who conceived you. For Abraham was one alone in the world, and I brought him to my service. I also blessed him and multiplied him. For Yahya will comfort Zion, he will comfort all her waste places, and he will make her wilderness like Eden, and her desert like the garden of Yahya. Joy and gladness shall be found therein, they that, they that offer thanksgiving, and the voice of them that praise. Listen to my word, O my people, and give ear, O my congregation, to my service. For the law shall go forth from me, and my judgment like a light. The nations which I led into captivity shall praise it. My righteousness is near. My salvation is gone forth, and the nations shall be judged by the strength of the arm of my might. The isles shall hope for my word, and they shall wait for the strength of the arm of my might. Lift up your eyes to the heavens and consider the earth beneath, for the heavens shall vanish away like smoke, and the earth that waxeth old like a garment, so shall it wax old, and its inhabitants also, they shall die. But my salvation shall be forever, and my righteousness shall not tarry. Hearken unto my word, ye that know the truth, the people in whose heart is the instruction of my law. Be ye not afraid of the reproaches of the sons of men, neither be terrified on account of their grandeur. For they vanish like a garment which the moth eateth, and like wool which rottenness seizeth. But my righteousness shall be forever, and my salvation from generation to generation. Reveal thyself, reveal thyself, put on the strength of might from Yahya. Reveal thyself as in the days of old, in the generations which were at the beginning. Was it not for thy sake, O congregation of Israel, <clears throat> that I broke the mighty, that I destroyed Pharaoh and his host, who were as strong as a dragon? Was it not for thy sake, O congregation of Israel, that I dried up the sea, the water of the great deep, I made the depth of the sea a way for the ransom to pass over. Thus the redeemed of Yaya shall be gathered together out of their captivity and come to Zion with singing. And everlasting joy shall be theirs, which shall not cease. And the cloud of glory shall shadow over their heads. They shall find joy and gladness. And there shall be an end of sorrow and sighing for the house of Israel. I, even I am he that comforteth you. Of whom are ye afraid? Of a mortal man? Or of a son of man who is counted like grass? And thou that should forget the worship of Yahya thy maker, who hath suspended <clears throat> the heavens and founded the earth, and should fear continually all the day because of the fury of the oppressor, as if he were ready to destroy. And where is now the fury of the oppressor? Vengeance hasteneth to be revealed, and the righteous shall not die in the pit, nor be in want of their food. For I am Yahya thy Allah who rebuketh the sea. Though its waves roar, Yahya of hosts is his name. 
I have put the words of my prophecy in thy mouth, and with the shadow of my power have I protected thee, to raise up the nation concerning which it hath been promised, that they shall be as many as the stars of heaven, and to establish the congregation it has been promised concerning them, that they shall multiply like the dust of the earth, and to say to the inhabitants of Zion, Ye are my people. Magnify thyself, magnify thyself, arise, O Jerusalem, who has received from Yahyah the cup of his wrath, the vial of the cup of cursing that thou hast drunk, and thou hast removed it. <clears throat> there is none to comfort thee of all the sons which she hath brought forth, neither is there one to lay hold on her of all the sons she has nourished. Two tribulations have come upon thee, O Jerusalem. Thou art not able to arise, when four shall come upon thee, spoiling and destruction and famine. And sword, there shall be none to comfort thee beside me. Thy children shall be torn in pieces. They shall be cast at the head of all the streets as broken vials. They are full of the fury of Yaya, and of the rebuke of thy Allah. Therefore, hear now this. Thou who art cast out, drunk with tribulation, and not with wine, thus saith thy Yaya, Yaya, even thy Allah will take vengeance of judgment for his people. Behold, I have taken away the cup of cursing, the vial of the cup of my fury. Thou shalt no more drink it again. But I will deliver it into the hand of them that afflict thee, which have been said to thee, Bow down that we may go over. And thou hast humbled thy glory as the ground, and thou becamest like the street to them that passed by. 